This moment, the little monkey sneaked up on him, seeing a tree with fruit on it. The old monkey climbed up the tree, but his strength was not enough, no matter how hard he climbed. He couldn't get up. The old monkey had no choice but to give up. He was so hungry that he picked up the bark of a tree on the ground. Suddenly, a fruit came down on him. He looked up and saw. It was the little monkey who had picked it for him from the tree. The old monkey's anger subsided. It turned out that the little monkey was not so bad-hearted. After eating the fruit, the old monkey threw away the core of the fruit. But he heard the sound of water running. He walked over to see. There was really a river. If you follow the river, I was sure to find a new hot spring. Now the old monkey had renewed hope. The snowstorm is getting heavier and heavier. The two monkeys trudge on through the snow, but soon the young monkey collapsed in the snow, watching the old monkey move away. The young monkey loses consciousness, but the old monkey doesn't leave him behind. He held the little monkey tightly in his arms, with his own body heat. He gave the little monkey a warmth. Soon, they were completely buried by the snow, and it was hard to tell if they would live or die.